Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Coastal Fermentory. You're with the Hophead Connoisseur, along with my co-star, Tony, over there, who's kind of sitting off in the distance because he does want to block up the logo in the background. Today, we're at Coastal Fermentory. We are here. It's not a Hoppy Friday. Today is Sour Friday. And if you've been following the Unicorn Rave series, uh, the last one is actually called Unicorn Rage with Black Current. That one was an 8% sour. The Unicorn Rave series is about 4.5%. Uh, they've been doing a dark, a light, a dark, and a light. So, you know, they go with a dark fruit, and then they do a light fruit, and then they go back to a dark fruit. So they've just been kind of going back and forth. Well, Unicorn Rage was done with Black Current, and this one here is Unicorn Rave, and this one is done with Mango Puree. And if you are a mango fan, and honestly, I just had my first mango today, this is delicious. Now you're probably thinking, well, you're just now doing the video, how did you have it already? Well, when the guys pour the beer into cans, sometimes it comes with what they call a short pour. So what they do is they take the label and they put it upside down so they know not to send that out to the general public. So I cracked the can earlier, taste this thing out because it wasn't on draft yet. Brandon was just putting it in the uh, keg, so I thought I'd try it out. And I will tell you, after eating a mango for the first time, I'm kind of surprised I haven't had one of those before because they are delicious. So again, we're down here at Coastal Fermentory. You can see the big logo in the background. Mike's back there working around in the cooler and everything. So if you hear the tractor in the background or the forklift in the background, uh, that's Mike back there working. So anyway, kind of excited about this. I always love the Unicorn uh, Rave series just because, like again, I got into sours. So I'm embracing the sour uh, community. And these are easy drinking, 4.5%. And I talked to Brandon earlier, and this one was actually done with mango puree. So, you know, they take the mango and they turn it into a puree, and that's it. And then... You know the guy is added into the beer and all that and yeah turns out beautiful I mean you look at this if you've seen if you've seen a mango before you know they're really nice and orange on the inside and honestly like when you look at that beer look how orange that beer is looks like orange juice right so um, yeah I'm a great fan of this I've always come up here for the unicorn rave series and like I said just easy drinking through the day especially on a hot summer day it's not too bad out here right now a little humid but for the most part still pretty reasonable so anyway let's go ahead and you know do what we always do smell the beer and then we're going to taste the beer and you know I'll tell you what my uh, take is on this so yeah you can definitely tell the mango and you can actually tell it's got a little bit of a sour it's going to have a sour uh, flavor profile to it so hmm smells so good though so cheers to y'all on Friday let's live give this thing a taste since I've already had one. <laughs> okay, so definitely get the mango flavor. Oh, it's so good. Mango's a little sweet, but with this being a sour style with using the mango puree, I would probably say it's probably got a pucker factor of one. That's on a scale of one to 10. So. Some of you might say, oh, it's got a pucker factor of one to two. Okay, I could, you know, go either way. But, you know, again, getting into sours, getting that kind of a tart sour profile, get the mango, and again, it's it's easy drinking. You know, it's not booze or anything. It's just got that nice, sour, flavorful, or fruity flavor. I think Coney might want some of this, don't you, buddy? You want some of that? Oh yeah, get your, get your, get your, get your, get your, get your mouth down in there. Yeah, <laughs> gotta watch this guy. Might find him on the bar later. But anyway, again, it's Friday. It's a beautiful day down here at Coastal Fermentory. If you're in the area, check this beer out. They open up at noon, and they will have this on draft today, and it is cans available to take home. Now, if you're now just now following me, you haven't turned on that subscribe button, click it, turn on your notifications so you can see when my videos come out and you can keep up to date with me. 
leave me a comment tell me if you've had the unicorn ray series before which one's your favorite i'll pass it on to the guys maybe they'll bring it back but for the most part i think they're going to try keep trying to do different fruits to the unicorn ray series so not happy friday hoppy friday sour friday drink it up enjoy the weekend remember to get out there and support your local craft breweries drink craft beer not crap beer we'll see you on sunday for subpar sunday